to YouTube so I get guidelines before creating content of this video. Do not, I do not encourage or condone any products, actions, or behavior shown in this video. All videos are produced in a safe, professional, and controlled environment. Please do not attempt to replicate any actions performed during the video. All actions are performed by professional. Yo, what is up, YouTube? Welcome back to another video, guys, with your boy, Sebi G. It's been a long one, bro. This is probably the longest that I've gone without uploading in a very, very long time. And honestly, there's no reason. I've honestly just been enjoying life, just been chilling, laid back, and there really hasn't been much to do. So I figured, why not just enjoy these couple of days off and just come back to YouTube whenever I feel like it, you know? That's the good thing about my freaking job, that I can do it whenever I want wherever I want all of that good stuff and take a break for my mental space to just be good all right so that would that's always been like kind of my goal when it came down to this job is just to be able to be stress-free all right and that's definitely one of the things that I appreciate about it so without further ado today we are gonna be trying for the very first time grab a leaf all right ladies and gents as you guys can see right there we got the grab a leaf all right so Depending on where you live, whether you're on the East Coast or West Coast, I know some people will call this Fronto Leaf, but it's completely different because it's completely different brands, I think. I'm not entirely sure if it's the same leaf, but they're different brands, right? Graba Leaf right here, it's supposed to be just a natural wrap and that's about it. I'm excited to try this out. Now, I was gonna buy the big one, but I was like, what if I don't like it, right? So I was like, let me just go ahead and get a small one, that way I could actually enjoy it, and if I do enjoy it, I'm gonna go ahead and head back and cop a couple more, honestly, because really, when it comes down to these like tobacco blunt wraps, I don't really like mess with them too often, but when I do, I like to enjoy it to the fullest, and that's why I've been going with the Brother Broadleaves, but the Graba, from what I've heard, and I've actually seen them mostly on the hot bar, YouTube channel shout out to those dudes a very chill awesome dudes we're supposed to be getting collab when they come to Cali and they were the ones who actually what well, they're the ones who where I actually saw this off of right so they hyped it up they say they love this so I'm gonna go ahead and try this out and see what it's all about just go ahead and tear it open try to pull this out I've never seen what it looks like inside of a, a small pack like this I know in the big pack you pull it out and it's a very huge leaf I might have to cop that next time just because it'll make the video a little bit better but yeah upon opening it so I guess you get two different leaves so you get two different leaves in YouTube this is just leaves right leaves off of a tree so this right here it looks completely different than what I'm used to so you pull this down it comes with a little stick right here how do you okay you unravel it like this this has to be one of the weirdest wraps that I've ever seen bro like honestly like the way that it just comes in there it doesn't look too visually appealing like if someone handed me a crumbled up little piece of leaf I would ask like what like what are you doing especially with this one I'm not gonna lie this one already is looking kind of funky we might have to use the other one and the way that they cut it bro the way that they cut it is not the move and this one right here holy is that mold yo we got a moldy graba no way I don't know if you guys can see that let me go ahead and try to focus it in but that right there that right there is mold all right it's like greenish yellowish all right bro ah oh, that that's low-key an L that is low-key an L I'm gonna go ahead and put this to the side let's go ahead and quickly though because these things will literally dry up faster than ever like these leaves when it comes down to these you cannot have them out of their packaging for too long because they will lose their moisture and then you're screwed all right you're gonna have to literally just go out and get another pack because I mean you could low-key technically wet it but I don't really like doing that stuff this one right here damn bro this one has a little bit of mold too a little bit though this one's way less and it's less prominent i don't know if we should chief that i might cut that little piece out but look i'm not gonna i'm not gonna cut this i'm not gonna go to the store i'm not gonna go buy another one you guys are getting the fully raw uncut savvy g we're about to go in on this mold pack all right so I'm gonna go ahead, this one seems a lot better, and I'm gonna go ahead and trim this down a bit because it is freaking huge, and then we're just gonna go ahead and pack this up, and we're gonna go ahead and see how the Graba is chiefing, but so far, I'm not really too impressed. I really am not. 
Now, I know this is probably just this pack. I mean, I know they're probably the shop that I went to. Who knows if they sell them consistently. So, you know, that's probably why it's a little bit. It doesn't feel stale. It feels nice and fresh. But that mold right there, I, who knows if it's even mold. I'm over here just like going crazy because I've never seen something like that. But it does look a little bit like mold, all right? So without further ado, I got some right here, some Tropicana Gushers. But yeah, let me know what your guys' experience is when it comes down to Brock leaf or even bronto leaves this is my first time ever trying graba i don't know if i already said that i'm pretty sure i did in the beginning but in my personal opinion i don't know i just never really it's not really a west coast thing i feel like that's more of like a like a new york thing you know the graba the fronto you put tobacco in your spliffs and stuff like that that's more of like an east coast thing for sure because over here in the west we do not do anything like that we don't we don't put tobacco in our stuff then if we're going to be using blunt wraps it's either going to be a backwood or most people are just stuck to their old ways and they're going to be using like swisher sweets and stuff like that but all at the end of the day it's all your personal preference but i do feel like if you are even going to be consuming like tobacco leaves you might as well be using the best of the best and like i said earlier that's why i usually only use brother broad leaves because the quality on those do they sell out i mean they sell out as soon as they drop so you know the quality is going to be fresh and from what i've seen i love their story two brothers and then they go out hand pick them hand qc them and that's what it's all about you know small batch high quality quality stuff because when it comes down to a lot of these high-end products that people come out with it just sometimes it's not really meeting like quality standards I guess you could say right that's why you have to have a pretty good QC team because if you don't then you're out of luck bud you're out of luck like you could do you have the perfect game plan but if the final product is not good then you're gonna be losing consumers at the end of the day like me personally depending on how this grab achieves like if i enjoy it then i might go back and get it but if i don't enjoy it that's like for first of all you already have the mold that you're dealing with number two the shape of this stuff is just super cut up funny you could literally use like with one of these you could cut it up probably use maybe like two maybe even three i don't really know but two for sure off of this so i do kind of like the amount that they give you but the wraps the way that they cut it up is just a little bit funky especially with this one right here this one's a whole a lot thinner compared to the other one and um yeah I, this one has a lot bigger mold and stuff like that so i'm not gonna i'm not gonna use that one i went ahead and got that out of the way now i'm not gonna lie with you this was a whole lot harder to roll than something else than than like if i would have used a brother's broad leaves or if i would have used like a backwoody even i'm not gonna lie to you guys and it, it's just because i feel like it's a whole lot more flimsier like it's really it, it just feels a little bit too fresh you feel me to the point where it has no stiffness to it so it doesn't like fold properly if that makes sense right so with that being said though we got the leaf right here ready to go just a quick little reminder for those of you who are watching this video today i'm going to be streaming a little bit later so make sure that you guys have the post notifications turned off and yeah you heard that right it's finally time ladies and gents because it's been literally like what two weeks almost three weeks that i've been getting all of my stuff i've had to wait for so much stuff in the mail and then i had to order more stuff because the setup wasn't working because it needed plugins blah 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 and um but now we got everything finalized the audio the stream everything looks on point all right so i'm excited i'm super super happy to get this get going for you guys again and um yeah you guys should be seeing that very very soon make sure to tune into the stream today and make sure that you guys go subscribe to the gaming channel because i'm going to be posting a whole lot more content on there i might be posting on there more than i'll be posting on here i'm not even going to lie to you guys just because i have more time to make those type of videos than i do to make these type of videos and that's just a whole 100 percent honest with you guys i'll make sure to have all of that stuff linked down below in the pinned comments or even in the description make sure you guys check out the description and not only that but i got another update so the cartridge thing that i told you guys last year that i'm going to be making this year it, it might be happening a whole lot sooner than i actually thought right so i have been talking to someone a good close friend of mine that's going to be um helping me
me out and pretty much finalize things and we're just waiting on a couple more batches of oil to come in a couple more batches of carts to come in and then we're going to be all hopefully finalizing it within the next couple of months so you guys are going to be seeing savvy g carts and maybe even some disposables and on top of that we even got some other things in the works right small batch flour you guys already know what i really love to do i'm going to be providing all of that stuff for you guys mm. got a little bit of scooby snacks I don't, like right here this is why I don't do videos in the car because it's very inconvenient I don't have all of my gear and uh, but today I was just on the go I was like let me go ahead and shoot a quick one but the Scooby snacks always freaking get me when I roll up thick ones like this and this leaf so far I'm getting no taste off of it which is usually what you like but it's hitting smooth and it's hitting super super smooth to the point where it literally feels like there's no wrap on the outside you do get somewhat of like a leafy aftertaste but barely it's barely even there and i'm not gonna lie with you so the flower that i got in here is probably not the most like crazy tasting so if you have some stuff that is even like super super fire and you put it in here it might be tasting a whole lot better but this conjunction right here is just already giving me a little bit of that head buzz that you know and enjoy with these wraps and when it comes down to the leaves really it just all depends on where they're sourced i've noticed that i've had leaves that like just completely boost everything and there's other leaves that just leave like a weird stomach ache feeling and it's just it's just not enjoyable you know so that's why you really have to be choosing from the right company making sure that you're not taking the cheap route out because if you're buying cheap stuff chances are that leaf is going to be cheaper It's been a long time since we shot a video in the car too, because I don't know. I don't know if it's because I'm getting a little bit older. I, I Maybe I'm just losing that, you know, that young mentality where you just don't care about anything. And now I'm starting to care about everything. Well, before I used to hotbox in my car all the time. I used to be in the whip all the time. No matter where I was, I really wouldn't care. We would be chiefing it up in the car. But now I'm like a little bit more paranoid than anything. But right now I am parked outside of my freaking house right now. And we're just just shooting this video you know but every single time i see a person pass by i see some wind i see a freaking bird i just get a little bit paranoid now i don't know what it is man it might just be that i'm getting old right your boy sabby g is becoming an old head now ladies and gents you guys saw me transition from a, a super young kid what was it when i started the videos i was like 20 yeah like 19 or 20 i think i was 20 and then Oh yeah, maybe 19. I don't really remember exactly. But when I started the videos, I was super young. And now you guys have who have been here from the start have seen me grow from a little kid to a grown ass man. All right, ladies and gents. So shout out to everybody who stuck with me throughout this entire time. And even shout out to all of the people who are new here. Right? I appreciate every single one of you guys because all my supporters are what makes this possible. Yeah, kind of enjoying it. Now, now that I'm starting to get into a little bit more of the leaf... It's starting to get a little bit more harsh because I feel like I'm starting to taste like that tobacco-y flavor from the leaf itself. And definitely when it starts reaching hotter temperatures, I feel like you get that more prominent leafy taste. And it just kind of hits you in the back of the throat, right? But for of the first couple of pulls, it was nice, smooth, it wasn't really noticeable. But now you're starting to get a little bit of that kickback and it starts to itch a, a little bit on the throat. But honestly, it definitely does what it needs to do, which is give you that little bit of that head rush nicotine boost, that tobacco boost, you feel me? Oh yeah, the more I hit the graba, the more I get that, that tobacco leaf. And I'm telling you, it just really, really smacks you. I definitely think comparing it to like the other leaves that I've tried, Brothers Broadleaf and um, Backwoods, I've tried a whole bunch of different leaves, right? But the best ones that I've tried, obviously, Brothers Broad Leaves, this right here, I would probably compare it to, honestly, like, uh, I would probably compare it to, I don't know if I would compare it to a Backwood. Like, for me, to be quite honest with you guys, it kind of is more so like a cheaper backwood okay that's just my personal opinion or, or who knows maybe it's just me not being a connoisseur and not really knowing the ins and outs of these wraps but who knows maybe this might be a higher end because 
you feel the effects more they're a lot more prominent whereas the backwoods you get a lot more of that taste and a little bit less of that tobacco in you right but with this one i just feel like it's a whole lot more prominent you could really really taste that leaf and it really boosts everything overall right so the graba first time ever having it will i have it again i think i might i think i'm next time though i'm gonna buy the really big pack of the bit the big leaf that way i can cut it up to my preferred liking and hopefully with that one there will be no mold all right ladies and gents but what is my official rating for the graba leaf i would probably have to give this maybe a solid a solid 7.5 out of 10 it's cool every now and then but it's definitely not for an everyday use or at least for me it's not so with that being said guys i'm gonna go ahead and end out the video here don't forget that i got a stream going on make sure you guys turn on the post notification bells don't forget to leave a fat like comment down below and i'll catch you guys on tomorrow's video